Ciudad Juarez is a city located in the northern part of Mexico, close to El Paso, Texas. This city is often simply referred to as Juarez and is definitely one of the first cities that many people think of when they think about Mexico. The population in Juarez has grown pretty dramatically over the past couple decades but unfortunately, so has the crime rate. As Juarez becomes a bigger and bigger city, the crime rate in this city rises, too. The number of people whose lives have been taken in this city puts Juarez in the top 50 for the most dangerous and violent cities in the world. Celia is a city in Mexico that has been a fairly popular tourist destination in Mexico for quite some time. Unfortunately, crime has been on the rise in Celia in recent years, causing the city to become less and less of a city that tourists should be putting on their travel bucket lists. Thought although the more tourist frequented areas in most cities in Mexico are relatively safe, there are still some cities that people should rethink visiting. Celia is a city that has a lot of tourist destinations and hotels that draw on many visitors. But the crime rate in this city has been increasing lately and it makes it one many tourists choose to avoid. For anyone that has traveled to Mexico or considered going there, including Acapulco 1 a list of cities in Mexico that are dangerous may seem unusual. Large parts of this city are incredibly safe and friendly to tourists. There are a lot of high-end resorts and hotels that make visiting this city a draw for people that want a luxurious vacation in Mexico. But outside of those luxurious, tourist-oriented areas, Acapulco is a pretty dangerous city. Outside of the hotels and luxurious beaches, there's a lot of poverty and problems with the quality of life in this city, leading to an increase in crime. If you're visiting Acapulco, it's important not to wander too far from your resort. Cozico Alcos is a city on the coast of Mexico that is known for being the birthplace of actress Salma Hayek as well as a number of other notable people. This coastal city has a long history and a lot of unique places for people that want to experience the culture of Mexico to visit. Despite the draws of the city, there are a lot of reasons that visitors should reconsider a visit to this port city. A large number of people who live in this city reported that they consider their city to be unsafe. Though the city may be good for a visit to see the coast and explore the city for a day, it's best not to stay too long. Tepic is a historic Mexican city located in the western part of the country. Although the city may look like one that visitors from all over the world would want to visit in order to experience the rich history and see the colonial Spanish buildings, Tepic is one city to skip. With a population of just over 500,000, there was enough dangerous crime happening that a warning was issued that people should avoid the area as much as possible. Although this was issued in 2017, crime is still a major concern in Tepic causing many visitors to avoid this city at all costs. Like Juarez, Tijuana is one of the first cities that many people think of when they think about Mexico. Tijuana is located right there at the border between the United States and Mexico and is a really busy border crossing. Although Tijuana is definitely an interesting city and one that many people visit because of the fact that it's so close to U.S. cities like San Diego, it's one that is still very dangerous. In 2019, OSA gave Mexico a level 2 rating, meaning that visitors should exercise increased caution if they choose to visit this country and cited Tijuana as one of the cities that is the most dangerous. Irapuato is a city in Mexico that doesn't have quite as large of a population as some other cities in this country, but it's still one that has become known for being a relatively dangerous city. Many tourists are advised to be careful when visiting Irapuato because of the rise in crime in recent years. Although the city had a fairly safe history, recent turf issues with rival cartel groups has made this city a fairly dangerous one, both for tourists and for locals. Even though there are a lot of tourist destinations in Irapuato like parks, zoos, and shopping centers, visitors are encouraged to be safe when visiting this city.